What's the new high ground? What's the new opportunity to really, you know, meaningfully change and disrupt how consumers interact with their dental plans? If we can bring the Internet of Things available through an electronic toothbrush, couple it with a dental plan that's sponsored by an employer to give feedback that the employees and the employer can take action on and, and make better decisions and have positive outcomes. That was the goal. I've never done a process like this in product development, but after going through this, I can't imagine doing it another way. This was an uncomfortable, hard process. We brought stakeholders in that, quite frankly, we didn't know what we were getting into and what we learned here today and then saw it all come together ultimately to benefit really an end user. I can't even begin to describe. I feel like I took a two-day college crash course, was hit by a truck, and then came out with something amazing. Being able to come up with a prototype, test it very quickly with end users, and identify that you have something that's really clicking, or you've got something that you've got to tweak, or something you've got to throw in the trash can, is really powerful. Getting the chance to work with actual customers, have them hold it in their hands, have them unpack the box, that's a real insight that I would never get. So I might spend years working on what I think people want as opposed to spending two days finding out what they actually want. You're much better off if you ask an end user early in the process. Uh, otherwise, you run the, the real risk of, of developing something that people just don't care about. Doesn't matter. We're providing dental insurance, but let's go beyond that. What can we do to improve your overall health, your sense of well-being? And if we can offer something new and innovative that they've never seen before, that's really a phenomenal value proposition.